Hello everybody, it's your girl Connie Kenneth, so welcome back to my channel and so if you're new to this channel, please make sure you subscribe and turn on your post notifications on if you're already a member of the Connie Gang, so thank you so much for your support and make sure you, you know, just share with your friends and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell another friend and so thank you so much guys for always, you know, for the support and for the positive feedback and I'm so grateful today to come back to you with uh, a new video so it's african traveler took me to a strange anti-gravity hill so it's by aussie so uh i'm so excited to watch this one i know that um you know he went to this place with african the traveler but the video you know is a bit too long so i chose to go you know to watch this one instead and let's see how it goes so yeah so welcome on the journey with me and let's get straight to this video and actually the same thing john has been driving yeah how was this was it? no the driving was so that is african the traveler um and so okay all right so they were together on the trip and i think african the traveler is in the video with his editor his video editor and so let's see what they have in store for us it was funny it was coming uphill yeah. but you feel like the car is in neutral yeah it's like it's very easy to go uphill fantastic to amazing we're together with my brother over here who, know, who doesn't know the african <laughs> traveler though bro like thank you so much for the magnificent work thank you like those videos oh, let me know where is aussie from uh he has an accent uh where is he from? Let me know in the comments below. I love and informative. This is the man. Of course, you know him. But I, I thank you so much. And also, Josh, please come around. Hi. Yes. Josh over here has also been helping a lot. Okay, so yeah, it's Aussie the Born Child. Enjoy. So thank you so much, Aussie, for the video. And please make sure you also subscribe and turn on the post notifications on. So, you know, you can know every time I upload a video. you know there is a lot of construction going on right now you know we can see that the roads infrastructure on point <laughs> a generous young man uh you know just the way he shouts out people with whom uh he is so he, he seems to be very grateful uh you know about you know being on this travel with them and so yeah so let's check it out it's an adventure all right let's go honest with you guys i've never heard once again about this point never heard about it why because we don't learn about it in school never and so i know the only thing i know about is the equator um you know next to naivasha but i've never heard about you know the machacos point where you know objects defy gravity you know it's an anti-gravity hill the kiamuilu hill okay so that's another hill no, it's not the Kia. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a Cha. I think they say the Cham Chamwilu hill because, you know, in Machacos, the campus, the KY is a Cha. So, excuse me. I'm sorry. So, don't come at me. <laughs> it's Chamwilu. Okay. <laughs>
I, I wouldn't call it strange, strange happenings, because it looks like there must be a scientific explanation to it. So I hope in this video we're going to know what, why, you know, the reason as to why, um, you know, there's this anti-gravity heel, so, and spot actually, so we'll find out. <laughs> actually the way um, uh, we found out about this spot it was by accident really okay so for those of you who probably don't know what's going on so apparently it's a spot which is uphill and you know when you uh, normally when you pour or if you drop an object and then you have uphill it goes downhill naturally that's how it's supposed to be but on this specific spot then the object goes uphill. So make it make sense. Make it make sense. Very strange. <laughs> The man on the wheels, African traveler, African traveler, <laughs> and over that side we have we have me, Josh Moore. Hi guys. <laughs> yes. So guys, I finally met him. <laughs> yeah, that's a video editor. Um. Okay, Josh Moore. <laughs> I'm honored to meet you, yeah. bro. So, brother, where are you taking me? So I'm me around to see the beautiful Kenya. So, uh, as I said. Uh, I saw your videos and Dennis the National uh, did some good work taking you around uh, yeah. CBD. CBD. I wanted to clean your mind first, taking you to the villages uh, in a county called Machakos. Yeah. It's a border, it borders Nairobi and I'm going to show you some awesome, awesome, awesome job, uh, views of this, you know, the village life uh, outside yeah. of Nairobi. It's, uh, it's not far from Nairobi, it's about 60 kilometers mm. and you're going to love it. It's beautiful, it's serene and the water is going opposite of the, you know, it's breaking the barriers, it's going against the gravity. Oh yeah. That's Definitely. what I want to see, I want to show you, as well as show my fans as well, oh, that uh, when you pour water on an uphill, instead of going down, it's going the opposite direction. So, so yeah, yeah, I hope you... Yes, that's what I told you guys, yeah, I think it's a phenomena apparently. So, oh, I'm curious to know. You guys are ready for that? Yeah. And go in the comment section, please say thank you to African Traveler. Thank you, Josh over here, the man with the big camera. <laughs> so I appreciate guys. You know, this is exceptional and you guys are very welcome to Uganda anytime. Thank you. And oh, so Osi is from Uganda. Okay, interesting. Ah, guys, let's go. Let's see what is there to adventure about. Do online content. Most of the time, you realize everybody's a judge. It's like the guy's in Newton, yeah? yeah. This is like in Newton, yeah. and yet indeed, we are climbing. Like, from the look of the eyes, we are climbing. Well guys, we are here and it's so surprising how the world is. So this area over here that you see, all over here, it's a place that defies gravity. Bro, what? yes. what's the press uh, Tamuilo and the gravity. Tamuilo, Tamuilo. What happened here? Bro? Oh yeah, I was right. 
Chamuilu. <laughs> Chamuilu. Okay, yeah, it's a K and a Y. You say Cha. Instead of what I'm going to do, uh, it goes up. It goes up. Yeah. And actually, the same thing. John has been driving. Yeah. How was this? No, the driving was fine. It was coming uphill. But you feel like the car is in neutral. Yeah. It's like it's very easy to go uphill. Even if Fantastic. Car, Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, like this is where the car comes from. It's also a dangerous spot. Like they should, you know, have some like security around this spot because they're in the middle of the road. You have cars passing by. So they should, you know, make it more secure and people can just maybe create a parking lot or space, something. Like this side is the slope. This side is the slope. And that side, that side over here. Okay, so yeah, on your right is the downhill and then you have the uphill. So if it makes sense to me, so let me know in the comments below, but um, if you pour water, then instead of the water going downwards, then it just goes upwards. What? Oh my goodness, I have to go to this spot. I have to. It's the hill, but if you pour water, you see these marks? If you actually pour water, water goes up. I want to go and get some more bit of the history about the press, like what is the name? But let me try to ask that to the African traveler over here, John. Let me try to ask that to him. The, the name of the place again? The place is Chamuilu Anti Gravity. Chamuilu Anti Gravity. So, and so and now we go the, the, the kind of people uh, spell KY as Chal. Yeah. Oh, Chamuilu. Yeah. Chalo. Yeah. So if you read it uh, in Swahili or English, it would be Kiamuilu. Kiamuilu. Yeah. Kia. Yeah. KY. KY. Kiamuilu. But in, uh, in Kamba, they always call it Chal. 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 Chalo. Chamuilu. Chalo. Chalo. Chalo is what? Chalo is this. Chalo. That's why. You are here. Oh yeah, yeah. The place is known as Chamuilu. Okay, okay. It's a combination of two brothers. Chalo and Chamuilu. Okay. They were twins. Mm. Ah, Chalo and Chamuilu. Yeah, ah, that's, okay. that's why the place is so called Chamuilu. Ah. Chalo and Chamuilu. Chalo used to stay. Oh, guys. Oh, I love this. I love this. Okay. So the name of the spot actually comes from twin brothers. You have the Cha and the Mwilu. Okay, so those were two boys. Okay. Oh. Down there. It's Mwilu. This mm. is up there. When they grew up, they married to one lady. Oh. My lady. The, Mwilu. <laughs> the lucky lady. <laughs> Mwende. They married to one lady. Oh, okay. Mwende. So, how, they, how decided, that they decided yeah. to share the relief. One week to Chalo, the other week to Mwilu. Yeah, I want to see Mwende. <laughs> I don't think I'm too bad. Me too. I want to see Mwende. She must have been a beautiful young woman and also very open-minded because back there's no sharing. You know, back in the days there was no sharing, no, you know. So, okay. So, Cha and Mwilu, twin brothers, and then Mwende, they, they got married to the Mwende lady. Okay. Two men that they get they, they, they decided. Yeah. They were twins. Oh that's how much they loved themselves. They loved the lady. The lady decided to share the both of them. Okay. So when they shared the lady, we believe when they got a baby boy, the baby boy was not for Jam. The um, baby boy was for Mulu. For, for everything follows to Mulu's area. That's why every Let me know in the comments below if it's if it's a true. Do you think it's a true story? Do you think it's just a, you know um, you know because back in history just to explain things 
uh, you know, uh, the, our ancestors, our elders used to, you know, invent stories just to, ma to make it make sense. Um, and so let me know in the comment section below if you believe in the story. So if I can help you. So the name of the anti-gravity spot is called Cha Mwilu. All right. And so Cha and Mwilu apparently were twin brothers who fell in love with the same lady called Mwende. Then she was pregnant with a boy and um, since uh, the, 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 the son didn't belong to Cha who used to live downhill, the, the boy used to go uphill towards the Mwilu. So that would explain the reason as to why you have this anti-gravity spot um, in Cha Mwilu and that's where the name comes from. So let me know in the comments below what you think about that. Really? No. <laughs> yeah, oh. So that yeah, is the yeah, fear yeah. of you. Yeah. That was interesting. Yeah. I got you now. Yeah. So everything goes up because, that because is... of Mwilu's. <laughs> Baby. Yeah. That is why everything yeah. goes up. When was this discovered that uh, water would go up a hill? When they discovered this, it was uh, the, 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 the wire. The guys who made this road in the first time. <laughs> oh, the guys, the guys who made the road. Yes, in the first time. Uh, yeah. They decided to make sure. So, yeah, the they... guy came up here. He found the guy is overheating. He put the car here. No one break. The car was off. No one break. He put the car stones. But when they found it, a little guy And like was pushing the car. The water decided to go up. Yeah, to Mwilu. Uh, and that is how it is insinuated yeah. that everything has to go up. But indeed, I think, well, I will, ask, I will take that. I have to do some research about this famous spot because uh, I need to know, you know, the I, I need to know the story, actually. I know there are all these... Um, stories that we, we have around it like you know with the Cha and the Mwilu twins and and also the person who discovered the spot and yeah it's it's quite interesting to see so let me know if you have more information in the comment section below <laughs> that the bottle they pushed the bottle downhill and the bottle came uphill what that's crazy <laughs> The camera cannot do it justice. We're together with my brother over here. Who, know, who doesn't know the African traveler though? Bro, like, thank you so much for the magnificent work. Thank you. Like, those videos are dope and informative. Thank you. This is the man. Of course, you know him. But I, I thank you so much. And also, Josh, please come around. Hi. Yes. Josh over here has also been helping a lot. That has been our day. I am really so super excited. And I hope you all liked it like I did. Until next time, I'll be seeing you in another video. We have been in the place called Chamuilu Anti Gravity Point. Bye bye. See you. So thank you so much guys. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. I loved it. And I love the charisma that he's got also. He looks like a you know like a genuine guy. Um and so let me know if you would like me to react to more of his videos and which one in particular. So just leave me a comment down below and I will most definitely uh do a reaction video on 
um, you know, the, the African Travelers channel as well. I know he does a lot of, you know, um, what do you call them, um, views of different cities in Kenya. And I will be so, you know, it will be an, an honor to, you know, to just to, to react to one of his videos. So thank you so much guys for watching and see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye.